in an imperial date. Um, currently, the law only requires uh, for national agencies isa lang ang card na nasa national level. Um, but for LGUs, of course, required yun sila. But um, for the information of everyone, ARTA is now uh, revising its guidelines to include CARP sa mga regional level na. So, uh, mauli siya ang legal basis. Uh, it's, in the, it's in the law, so we will not go further into that. I'm just going to the more important um, items. So the JMC for the CARP uh, was a product, is a product of public consultations held in uh, August 2020 with inputs from the NGAs themselves no, and the LGUs. So the Committee on anti Tape, ang pinaka-function of the CARP is to ensure strict compliance with the provisions of the law. So if um, we know, no, we understand that uh, ARTA is on, only a very small office, um, this is the wisdom behind it. Yeah. The CARP, no? if they directly monitor ARTA, they will ensure the compliance of their office to the law. So um, uh, what, what, what are covered? So this includes state universities, local government units, GOCCs, uh, and other government instrumentalities in the Philippines or abroad. No? So this include our consular offices there at the FBA, mga offices nasa abroad, who are covering business and non-business related transactions. So for the composition, the card shall be composed of a chairperson, a vice chair, and at least five other members. So you can have five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten total members. So wala siya yung maximum. <clears throat> so the agency may also designate a subcard in the respective regional field office. Uh, so mauna ni, so in the current law, it only encourages no, the creation of the card sa region. Uh, but it will be required once the new guidelines will be approved. So, so, so government agency, the uh, chair usually is the head of the of the agency. And this the, the membership will compose of the planning, core operations and internal audit, information technology, uh, the following the human resource, admin and finance public assistance complaint centers, and in some cases, an at home PIO also, because the Public Information Office performs an um, important role for the dissemination. So if you will be organizing a part for the regional level, this is the recommended or uh, the composition as per the guidelines nato currently. So the functions of the the functions of the part uh, mirrors um, uh, uh, function, roles and responsibilities of ARTA. So it is the responsibility of the CARP to review, number one, to review your assistance if there is a need to the engineer or to streamline a lot of mga processes. And then number two, to comply with the guidelines set of the National Policy of Regulatory Management System to be issued by ARTA. Ensure effective knowledge transfer of information dissemination among employees. So this is a very important na atong mga employees uh, are aware no, of the provisions of the ease of doing business no. In other government agencies like DNR, na sila ay ganang grand annual, ba't tumagda? Is that an annual seminar ba? Or something like that. Na sila annual, annual seminar or capability building. And part of that, na yun sila yung module of ease of doing business. To continuously remind the employees Right, uh, so another function is to set up and update your citizen starter, and then you have to submit it to the ARTA electronic management system. Uh, it is also your duty, sa CARP, to monitor and review the agency or office's citizen starter, specifically the procedure steps, etc. And ensure that updates of the citizen starter are posted to your website uh, in the handbook and on your tarpaulins or not later than March 31 of every year. Okay, ensure agency implementation of the zero contact policy. Ensure compliance with the 3720 processing time. Develop 
and foster a client feedback mechanism and client satisfaction measurement and report to part of the results of the client satisfaction survey at the last working day. Dr. Marich, I think, um, uh, have you already submitted, sir? Are you aware that you submitted the ANI in measurement, client satisfaction survey? So, I give all the national reporters. I give the national reporters. I give all the national reporters. I give all the national reporters. I give all the national the the Client satisfaction. I centralized pa. Pero if that will, ang card na is baba na sa regional level, hindi rin na siya. Okay, so establish and manage the public assistance and complaints desk. So, tanan ba ang atong mga fire stations na yun natin, sir? Ang update. Sir, thank you, honestly. Mostly, sir. Mostly, sir. Mostly, sir. Mostly, sir. Mostly, but we are going the modernization of the public even our regional but some of the typical public because uh, when we go around this is also one thing na at the office ay pasinaan na sila yung special instructions po, special instructions para magtugma ang atong kanal. And then, uh, so, okay. So, I guess that's it, no? For the orientation ng the card. Uh, once you organize na, once na anay card CPFP, original level, anapatay mas detailed na orientation. So, just inform us, sir, once na anay, ano, Order para makikengage na kung ibali a more in-depth na uh, training for uh, the part. So for now, wala pa man isa time, ano, time, time frame. We're still waiting for the guidance. But mas maayon na nakaprepare na daan si, ano, si BFP. In a way, it's not difficult naman once you identify the persons, just issue the guideline, just issue the, the office order. So, um, Yes, uh, that's So we at the BAP, we are ensuring that we are 100% uh, complying with this uh, guideline, sir. So um, among, as of now, as you honestly, we are monitoring the, especially the business one-stop shop at the same time.